Do you have a hard time receiving without feeling like you need to return the favor? I want to point out some things that hopefully will be in support of you. We were discussing this in group coaching this week, and I found that you know it is a very common issue. I know that I used to struggle with the same in my past. And one of the things that's really interesting is that when you actually deny someone from giving you service, love, support, doing things for you, you are actually denying that person being able to support you. We tend to think about the fact that it's really hard to receive and that we're being a burden to somebody and that we don't want to, you know, put a person out. And yet the person who is offering has done so of their own free will and they are choosing to do this thing for you and you are actually denying their love and the good feelings and everything, the dopamine that they're going to get from serving you, supporting you. And they might be wanting to show up for you because it's possible you're one of those people that tends to give to people a lot but doesn't receive and they're looking for an opportunity to give back to you so don't deny the people who love you who want to give back to you by not receiving when they offer you love and support and know that you don't have to reciprocate because they're actually giving back to you because you've already given and they are absolutely getting out of the exchange. They're getting those beautiful feelings when you contribute to somebody's life and you make their life easier, better. You lighten their burdens. So allow yourself to receive. Another thing that is very important is to allow yourself to be fully present in the receiving. So when somebody offers you something, what you want to say to signal to them and to your brain, one that you are in gratitude, two that you are present with this happening, I actively receive, thank you. This way you are actively present in the moment receiving the service, the gift, whatever it is that the person is offering to give you as support. You are acknowledging it. They are being validated and recognized for the service that they are giving and you are being signaled to, to be present in the moment and to actively receive that thing. So I hope that you find this supportive. I want to see each and every one of you love and thrive. If you want to create a new you for the new year and you want to dance with all sorts of beautiful concepts to expand your reality and become your best self for 2023, book a soul connection with me and I would be honored to hold space for you. Mwah.